Well, here we are, midweek, midweek, late week. It's Thursday, Thursday afternoon. I just got done having a barbecue with a couple of real nice friends of mine, and Dave called and said he had some spot silver for me, and I was just so pleased. Uh, silver was down a buck today, so I saved a buck on everything he picked up this morning. And uh, let's get to it and see what we got here. I think there's, let's see... 17 half dollars. Ah, that's a nice mixture. Let's see. It doesn't say how many of each, but I like Walking Liberties, but they're all nice half dollars. All pre 64s. Then uh, he said oh, I got some quarters. So I said, okay, so we got 16 quarters, then he said, I got some dimes, and I said, well, I love dimes, and a lot of these, I haven't even looked, to tell you the truth, I haven't even looked through the, oh, there's a, there's a very nice, a very, very nice barber, I'll show you that in a minute, I haven't even looked through those dimes, maybe I should have done that first, and so, how many mercs there were and so forth and so on. Seems to be a lot of mercs in there. And also, look at this. There's a, from the Mercantile Exchange, there's a, or let's see, the Silver Bullion Exchange. There's two, two one, one ounce, uh, 0.999 coins. There's a commemorative 999 and memorial January 28th. 1886. I guess that's when we lost some people with NASA. Here's a, a beat up uh, 1990 uh, Eagle. Some mint one dollar bullion or one one ounce bullion. Here's a oh you'll just love this one. One ounce We'll have to do for the straight straight guys in the audience. One ounce of Marilyn Monroe. I'll set that aside so we can you can zoom in on that. Here's some other commemorative. It's a uh, I haven't uh, had a chance to look at it yet, but I got that for the same price as a fifty cent piece, and I think it's I think it's a sterling. And then here's a one a one ounce Farmers Merchant National Bank. A Bridgeton, one ounce. Let's see what's the date. Let's see a date. Oh. No, let's. Let's see a date. But one ounce. That's that's a town real close to us. And then a maple leaf. And to the maple leaf. 1987 Eagle, 1989 Eagle, oh in good shape, 2001 Eagle, another 89 Eagle, must have been a good year, let's see, one Troy Ants, 1990 Eagle, two thousand and one Eagle, nineteen ninety one Eagle, and oh, nineteen eighty seven Eagle. I don't know how far back the Eagles go. I think they only go back to eighty six. And another ninety one Eagle. So this was my silver take for today and let's see if we can get a close-up of Maryland and some of these other coins let's see old Maryland uh, she looks pretty good I guess for being dead all these years and it's funny it's a coin that has her on both sides, so you get to see both sides of Maryland. <laughs> and here's that 
Here's that Barber dime. That looks in good shape. There might be a bunch of these in there. I don't know. I'll have to go through them. And then here's the, the general one answers. I think there were 17 in all of them. And oh, happy how happy I am. I mean, very nice of Dave. Get all this, get the, get the Eagles at spot. And all this at spot. And considering that uh, we just plug in and see what spot is when he was here. And it was down a dollar today. So I'm very, uh, very happy with this acquisition. And Dave's supposed to go back and uh, and get some Morgans and the Morgans that aren't collectibles. And I'll I'll uh, hopefully uh, be able to get them for spot. I love Morgans, but here's what I love most: these dimes. Nothing quite like Merck dimes. So I hope everybody's having as good a week as I am with silver. I got no idea where where this whole thing is is going. I mean the if uh, China f China faces a slowdown, then so could silver. But we're looking for the long haul. So I think this will, regardless of what silver does in the next three or four months, this will we will look back and this will be jump cheap silver. So everybody uh, keep stacking and leave me a comment. All my regulars are leaving me. I don't know what the deal is, but. That's the way it goes. Oh, here we go. We can have a contest for... I don't have any Morgans left. Let's see, for a couple of... Two of these half dollars. And the contest will stop on Sunday. And the contest will be... What was my total cost for this beautiful pile of silver? That might spark some interest. And... And I know there's one barber dime. So if there's two people, and round it off to the closest dollar, because I did. And if there's more than one person that gets the right dollar, then you'll have to tell me how many total barber dimes there were in this pile. And that'll break any tie. So, everybody, please leave a comment, too. Let me know where you've been, because it seems when I don't have a contest, you get lost and then uh, found again when I do, so... Please let me know what you've been up to and uh, if you're stacking some yourself. See you, uh, I guess, now Sunday sometime.